Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I will show you how to do about the Excel. Before we open the file, we need to save the file like this. We change from number one to number two. So you go in this one, save as and browse in here. Now, after you open the file, you got like this. The first thing we go to the budget summary, we go in here. The next one, we cut about this one and we go to this one in here. Later that, we can see that they will highlight and we pass in A number one. We go in here and they will finish about number one. The next one, E number two. E number two, that's the form here. And we need to put number of, and that is in here. So we just finished number two. Number three, that is about location in here. We write about quarter number two. And number three the next one on the cell tree number five that's in this location we need to put about e number five minus f number five if you don't know you can go in here we can see that they just do e number six minus f number six so in this one we have the equal sign and we put e number five minus F number five and that is about number four about number five you go to this quarter number one in here and they want to ask about the profit gross profit and we need to put B number six that is B number six and divide by B number five So we have this one and we put this one go like this because they want to fill the range in here. After we finish number five, we go to number six. On the number six, they want to go to E number 10. About E number 10, we can use the sum in here. That is about the total. So we go highlight this one and we close the bracket and you got this number in here and we need to fill handle from E11 to E13. Then we go in this one. So on the cell F number 10, we go to this number in here. We fill the number and you got this number on the tree number 10. Tree number 10, that is in this one. So they want to use about the target cell and the regional cells. So the target cell, that's the F number 10 in, in here and E number 10 in here. So we use this one minus this one. And now uh, we need to fill from 311 to 314. So they should be like this. The next one, we edit the cell B15. So we have the cell in here. We need to edit. And now we have this one divided by this one. So we need to put the dollar sign. We press F4. F4 that should be on on the keyboard you have F4 in here just go to F4 and you got this number and the next one on the cell B20 that is in this location and we need to put about B19 Divide by the cell B5.
and they should be like this. So to make sure you need to go to this one to check all the numbers in here. After you got all the numbers, now we go to 2D pie chart. So the question they want to find A number 9, A13. So here is about A number 9 to A13. And uh, because this is about non abstract we need to put control and we go to E number 9 to E13. After you got this one, you go to insert, go to here, or go to pie chart. So we go to 2D pie chart. They should be like this. And now we need to edit about the chart title. So I will copy this one. Control C. Then we change for this one. Delete and Control V. Then we have this one in here. Now we need to put at I number 4. I number 4, let's see in this here. So we go to I number 4 and the next one that is about L18. L in here, 18 go in here. So they should be like this I number 4, L18. Okay, after we got this one, we apply style of number 3. So we go to number 3 in here, style number 3. And the next one, we need to hide the real lines. So we go in here. Oh, that's it from view. So we click in here. And you can see that you don't see the line anymore. And this is the answer for all the questions.